suspect is an East Harlem resident named Kenneth Minor, who has been convicted of serious crimes on seven separate occasions. Kenneth Minor had a criminal career background as being a thief, but he was a small-time drug dealer. Minor tells me that he first sees Locker at about 2.30 a.m., less than two hours before he dies. At the time, I was drinking, and um, I was doing some cocaine, and um, you know, that was normal for me because I was circling pretty much, I call it circling the drain. Circling the block is a Caucasian man behind the steering wheel of a black car. How many white people in nice cars drive around that particular neighborhood? You'd be surprised. So it wasn't so odd to see him there. It's odd to see them approach us at that time of night. Once he stopped, I knew that he was looking for drugs. Yo, how you doing? But Locker wants something else. If you could help me out. What's up, man? I need a gun. A what? No, I'm serious. I'm, I'm looking for a piece. A gun? So you believed him? You believed him? I believed him. But I told him to get out of here. I got the f up out of here, man. You're crazy. Because all I got to do is whistle behind me. And 15 animals are going to rip you to pieces. Stop, man. I don't know what you're talking about. Locker returns to his car and drives away. But according to Miner, 20 minutes later, Locker shows up again. So what happened? That impressed me, because I thought I put the fear of God in him. And he wasn't scared. I said, I got to hear this guy out. I got to. I'm, I'm curious now. What's up? I need you to do something for me. Where I come from, I've seen a lot of desperation. So when I met Mr. Locker, I recognized that desperation. Miner says he asked Locker for a down payment on the gun. Give me 60 bucks and I'll see what I can do for you. He gave you 60 bucks. $60 couldn't get you a bullet. $60 is getting you nothing. But he didn't know that. I was testing him to see how far he'd go. I'm going to try to get as much money as I can from you and get out of here. I'll call you. All right, you do that. We got a deal. But at this point, he thought you were going to go off to get a gun. He thought so. The two men part ways. Within an hour, Jeffrey Locker will be dead. <laughs> <laughs>